Hey guys, today I'm going to teach you how to do this exactly. So your Hype project, you want to export it and in to put it into your web page. So I'm going to teach you how to do that. Put that right into your web page, okay? So this is for an existing web page that you're making on Dreamweaver. And here we go. So just on Hype, go into File. Okay, once it's all done, just make sure it's all good. I'm going to export as HTML5 folder. Once you're in folder, make sure you have all these check marks on. Okay, except for show build with hype, unless you guys want that. Uh, I'm gonna just put it on my desktop right now. I'm gonna name it condos, and we're just gonna put save. Okay, so that's on my desktop at the moment. I'm just gonna close this, close this, because I don't need it anymore. On our condos folder, which is right here, okay, that we just made, it's on our desktop. We just have to open that up. Okay, so might as well take these out from here because you guys don't need them here. I see that there's some problems once you leave them in that folder. It is more organized to do that, but sometimes it creates problems, especially for me, it has. So um, we're going to go into the folder where you have all your web page stuff. Okay, so wherever you're saving your web page into, open that up. So that's this folder for me. So here's my HTML from before and other HTML files that I have, my index and everything like that. I have other ones that I've made as well. So what you guys want to do is just drag these two out of there and put them here. Okay. And then you don't need this folder anymore that we created. So this folder should be empty at the moment. We can just delete that. Okay. So you guys don't need that anymore. Now you have those two here, right? So we want to open this one up, HTML. We want to open it up on our Dreamweaver right now. It's just to view the code. So just going to Dreamweaver open. Okay, and look for that. So it's condos HTML. So we're gonna open that up. Remember those two files. One is HTML, so open that one up. And there we go. So the reason why we're opening this up on Dreamweaver is just to view the code because we have to copy some lines. So here it tells you what lines to copy. You have to copy this one. So we're just gonna put command C to copy that. Go into our web page and you're gonna put that here. So you're putting that on your HTML, not on your CSS. Um, so that's right here on top of your head. You should have this, okay? So copy and paste that into there, okay? Next thing that you guys have to copy and paste is your second part, which is just right down here. So copy these lines to your document, okay? So just copy these, okay? So before you copy these, make a container. I suggest making a container before you do this. So I made a div. I'm just going to copy it right now. Okay. So you can have that copy. Go back to your HTML file. Now, right here, I have my containers. So here I have one of the things. Okay. And that's one of the, uh, my containers. I'm going to show you that in a second. Um, I'm going to put it on live view because it might show me what's going on here. So that's my one container that I made before. Okay. Um, and this is my second container that I wanted to go below this one. So here it is, container four. So I'm gonna put it in between this one, inside this div that I made. And I haven't styled it yet, but there we go. We just paste it and that's all you guys need to do. So we refresh it and it should go down here. So there we go. So from there you guys can style it with CSS, make some space for it, margins and all that stuff. But this is basic how you do it. Uh, once you do that, you're all good. Remember to put your files in the correct place, okay? I cannot stress enough that you should go everything in your folder, okay? In your folder where your web page is at and everything is linked up. It will work perfect if you do it this way. If you don't have things linked up properly, they will not work, okay? Make sure everything's in one file. And uh, yeah, it's going to be easier than you think. And this should work right away. Um, even if you don't see it on live view, okay? Remember, on live view, you will see your things. Without live view, you guys will see this, which is pretty much a nothing, okay? Um, if you guys see that you have any problems with your divs or anything like that, you can write them here below in the questions com in the questions uh, area, which is just the comments. Um, anyways, comments, questions, problems, write them here below, and don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.